Yeah, remember you can catch premium sporting content by downloading the Sportsmax app from the Google Play or the App Store. So much for you to enjoy, including WTA tennis and the ongoing series between West Indies and South Africa. The test matches are done, but the T20s come up starting on Friday and you can catch it on the Rush channel inside the app yeah get downloading today moving along now world and olympic 100 meter champion usa's noah lyles is again grabbing the social media spotlight after coming to the defense of his jamaican girlfriend Junel bromfield this is what he posted on x i just want to say how incredibly proud i am of my girlfriend and give her the flower she deserves now she has been through so much in her life that I could never imagine um, fighting through. Beyond that, she is a survivor, a two-time Olympian, Olympic medalist, multiple world championship medalist, and has been representing Jamaica on the world stage she, since she was eight years old. But the most impressive thing I've seen recently is how she's dealt with the pure disrespect and hatred towards her from her own country. This woman has been attacked by people who have never met her, heard her name before, and never seen her smile or heard what she believes in, but she keeps moving forward knowing that God will always make a way. That is why God keeps blessing her. Lance Whitaker, Noah Lyles, mm -hmm. coming to the defense of his Jamaican girlfriend. You know what, Ricardo, as I've said on the show so many times, I'm, I'm not a social media person, and I, I, I prefer to follow what these athletes do on the track as opposed to what happens on social media. And I am aware of a lot of things that had been said about her. Very unfortunate, um, and a lot of uh, attacks on her personality from as Noah Lyle said from people who don't even know her they have never met her they know they know nothing about her but yet they go on social media and say the most mean and caustic things about her I just think that sometimes people are a little bit too emotional in in these social media comments and um, I get where Noah Lyle is coming from although I, I know that he has provoked a lot of um, anger from, from, from the Jamaican community. So, you know, he himself is, uh, for my money, a little bit too active on social media as well. <laughs> well, I tell you what, I've known Janelle Bromfield from, she was at St. Elizabeth Technical High School, um, covered her, she was a, a fantastic um, high school athlete. And remember, she also won a world under 2400 bronze medal um, for Jamaica. Now, a lot of the things that people have said about Janelle Bromfield in recent weeks um, have just been um, downright evil, Yes. Um, unnecessary. Um, in my opinion, Janelle Bromfield has done nothing wrong. Um, Janelle Bromfield, at least based on what Noah Lyle said, um, she's not told Noah Lyle's anything that most of us within um, the track, track and, and field, field circles didn't already know. Couples have pillow talk all the time. Um, it's part of relationships. Um, and there is absolutely nothing wrong with that. You could make an argument that um, Noah Lyle's coming and speaking publicly about it was wrong and he should not have done that in the way he did. But I don't understand um, why all of this vile is being directed at Junel Bromfield. Yes. Um, I think um, all, everything is being directed at the wrong person and it is unfortunate because the young lady does not deserve it. She has always represented her country um, with pride. I'll give you a quick story, Lance, since I'm already on this. I went to the 2014 Youth Olympic Games um, with Janelle Bromfield. Um, that was a really good team, by the way. Um, Jamaica did really well in Nanjing, China, and Bromfield didn't you, do you so went, well. You went there to cover the games? Yes. Okay. No, you said with <laughs> Janelle Bromfield. So Lance, just to make it clear to our Lance, viewers that you didn't I, go to the games <laughs> with her, you went to the games to cover the and she was a part of the team. Okay. Thank you, you very much, Lance. Yes. I appreciate that. <laughs> no, she didn't do so well. Um, in fact, I don't think she made it out of the first round of the 800 meters. That's the event she was contesting at the time. And I remember at the end of the Youth Olympic Games, she said to me, Ricardo, I will not allow this to happen to me again. 
I am going to work so hard to ensure that the next time I represent Jamaica, um, I am doing extremely well. And Lance, that young lady worked so hard and it showed in her results at the high school level subsequent to that where she dominated at girls champs. One year she won the 400, the 800, the 50, and the 1500 15, yeah. meters. Yes. She also tried the hurdles at one stage, the 400 hurdles. Mm -hmm. And then in 2016, when she was the favorite, by the way, to win the World Under 20 title going in, and she finished third after a long, difficult season, and Tiffany James won, that was her crowning moment as a junior. So I say all of that to say that this is a young lady who has always looked forward to representing her country, who loves her country. And for people to be saying the things that they have been on social media is, is really unfortunate. It's really, really unfortunate. And she does not deserve any of it. Yeah, I agree with you 100%. But the fact that she's dating Noah Lyles immediately sets her in a position that Jamaicans are going to be against her or, or some Jamaicans are going to be against her. Unfortunately. Yeah, it was... Unfortunately. Yes. I agree it's unfortunate, yeah. Yeah, I mean, that's the show. <laughs> Whoa! It's six o'clock, Lance. Can you believe it? Yes, We're I out can. of time. Yeah. Whoa! Thank you very much for joining us. By the way, it was a fun show. We'll be back tomorrow. And tell you what, you don't want to miss tomorrow's show. You don't want to miss tomorrow's show. It's gonna be special, 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 special. And we have a very special guest who is gonna be joining us for a bit, and he'll have a lot to say. You won't want to miss that. Take care. We'll be back tomorrow. Umpire Farrant in a tree. He say, all right, fellas, all you ready? And the ones in the crowd start to sing very loud. Hit the ball, donkey, hit the ball. Cover, drive him and make him ball. Hook the man like Ali Charan and put him straight in the stand.